Welcome, Cancer, to uh, what messages does your special person here have for you? Weekly Love Tarot Reading. Uh, for those of you that are new to the channel, I'd like to welcome you guys and thanks for dropping by. And for those of you returning, welcome back. And of course, thank you for your continuous support. So as always, the reading here, it is going to be a general tarot spread. So please just take what resonates with you, Cancer, and discard the rest. Or perhaps you may be interested in a weekly, um, sorry, in a personal tarot reading. Um, if that's the case, please feel free to reach out. I will list my email address just below the video here in the show more section, along with all the different types of readings that I offer. So the spread that we're going to be looking at here, it is intended for Cancer, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. And of course, for those of you that are cross-watching as well. So let's take a look at the messages here your special person may be wanting to tell you. What is it that he or she wants to communicate to you? Okay, what is it that they're trying to um, get across here? What does the tarot want you to know here about this individual cancer? I've got a few cards that went flying here. Okay. I've got the Ten of Cups here and the High Priestess. The Ace of Swords here. Six of Cups, the Nine of Swords here, and the Ace of Cups. Okay, so I can see you're dealing with a possible, um, with a strong water energy, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpio. Also strong um, air energy, a Gemini, a Libra, and Aquarius. It can also be a fire sign or an earth sign, but I just have to point that out, right? Um, I just have to. Okay, guys, um, what is it that your person is wanting to communicate to you here? Okay, so I can see that you're dealing with someone who seems to be very, right now, their present energy seems to be very overwhelmed. Um, they seem to be in an anxious state of mind here. I feel like possibly the two of you aren't communicating Um Maybe you're going through a period of separation here, a period of silence. This person is thinking about you a lot. In fact, they seem to be stressing over the fact that the two of you aren't communicating, the two of you aren't talking. I feel like maybe this person has tried to reach out in the past, but maybe it didn't go down uh, so well here. Uh, but this is someone who's missing you greatly here, uh, Cancer. I feel like this is an individual here who harbors very strong romantic feelings for you. But I also feel in addition to that, it feels like this person is also a great friend here, okay? Someone whom I feel like you've had a very strong spiritual bond or a very strong connection. Basically, this person wants to reconnect here, okay? They want to revisit a, a connection or a relationship or a memory they had with you here. I feel like this is someone who has been thinking about you a lot. I can see they're a little bit overcome by a wave of nostalgia here. Um, I feel like there's been some sort of emotional challenge, like an emotional challenging period between the two of you. Maybe you guys separated, maybe temporarily, maybe permanently. But this person doesn't want to, they don't want to move away from you, okay? I feel like they don't want to end things with you. Um, they feel like there is still something there. They feel like you will always be very special to this person, to them. Um, and they also feel like whatever, you know, whatever this emotional challenge, challenging um, period that you're experiencing they truly believe that the two of you can overcome this and come out on the other side of it this is someone who's wanting a future with you cancer okay this is someone whom you've also elicited some very strong emotional um, responses or reactions in them i feel like this person is uh, upon meeting you i feel like this person you've evoked a strong emotional reaction within them but i also feel like there is something here that transpired between the two of you which caused them to react um maybe even overreact here greatly i can see that this person wants to communicate okay this is someone who i feel like may be losing sleep or uh, their energy seems very restless here. They seem very bothered by the fact that you guys aren't communicating. They seem bothered by the fact that you guys aren't where you both need to be in the relationship here. With the High Priestess, though, I feel like you may not necessarily see this side to them, okay? And especially if they're a water sign, water signs have this ability to sort of... Um, 
masquerade their emotions. They're truly deeply sensitive beings. Um, but because they're so sensitive, I feel like that's their coping mechanism. You know, they like to protect, they, they like to guard and protect and shield their beautiful, gentle hearts here by coming across as, you know, the high priestess type of energy, someone who's very, um, can be tough to read or someone who can appear as though they have a tough exterior, but um, that's not the case. This is someone who I feel like is very sensitive and this is someone who has strong romantic feelings for you. I feel like this person is in love with you or has fallen for you here, okay? The high priestess also get a sense that the two of you share a psychic connection, okay? I feel like you know, whenever you find yourself thinking about this individual, it's because you have been weighing heavily on their mind. There is also something else that's been, I feel like there is something here that's really been bothering them. Maybe the last time you guys spoke, maybe what was said, maybe there was a misunderstanding or a miscommunication between this person. Um, they feel like there is something here I feel like there is something here that they want to tell you, but they either feel like you're not willing to listen or they feel like they can't necessarily gather your gather their thoughts and um, you know tell you what it is that uh, they want you to hear. There's something here I feel like that they're um, holding on to, some communication. They want to talk, but I feel like they're having a hard time opening up, right? Hypersis is big on intuition, so I feel like you, you know, and you are a water sign. I feel like you know strongly who, who it is that I'm referring to here. You have a very, you have a very strong bond or strong connection with this individual here. I do get a sense that you guys have sort of cut ties, whether permanently or whether um, temporarily. I feel like you guys aren't talking right now, and to be honest with you, your silence is killing them. It really bothers them here, Cancer. They want to talk, they want to communicate, they, over they want to overcome whatever you guys are experiencing right now. They're missing how things used to be between the two of you. They're missing how it was in the beginning. They feel like you guys can go back to the start. They feel like you can have a fresh emotional start and overcome whatever this, you know, emotional um, challenging situation that you're both dealing with here. Okay, Cancer, so these are your messages from your special um, person here. They have been thinking about you and this... This is someone who harbors some great, um, a lot of uh, romantic uh, feelings for you here, okay? Uh, so thank you again for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to this channel, by liking, sharing, or commenting below. For those of you that would like a reading, feel free to inquire. Otherwise, take care, guys, and I will catch up with you later in the week.